Judge Stern is not letting this disease get the best of her. She's already had surgery to remove the cancer, but she just started what many would call the worst part, chemotherapy and radiation. Even while battling breast cancer, Judge Rebecca Stern remains the boss of this courtroom. She found out in January, and today is her first day back on the bench since her first chemotherapy session on Friday. I was trying to time the chemotherapy on a Friday afternoon so that by Monday I'd feel good again. And the ironic thing is I felt great all weekend, and then this morning I woke up feeling really draggy. But Judge Stern could have been worse had she not acted quickly. While doing a routine checkup, doctors found invasive lobular carcinoma. That's a type of breast cancer that usually spreads easier since it's not shaped like a lump. She had surgery that same week, and since then, fellow judges, family, and even drug court clients have been supportive. You immediately start thinking what could happen the worst, you know. And what could I do to make sure everything's taken care of? My philosophy has always been to live like it's your last day. And so, so I'm pleased, you know, that most of my life I've done the things I've wanted to do. Over the next nine weeks, she'll go through three chemotherapy sessions. After that, there's seven weeks of radiation, and Stern expects to lose most of her hair. But she says she's more afraid of the cancer coming back. You know, and if I have a bruise, I think I've got, you know, um, some other cancer. If I have a twinge in my side, I think I've got bone cancer. I mean, you can't help but think that way. You think it's all over. Make sure by the end of the week that you're at this office. But Stern says since there's a plan, she feels lucky and objects to this disease overruling her life. I don't want to miss any more work than I have to. For one thing, I enjoy it and it makes my life seem normal. But also I have a huge docket to take care of and a lot of people, you know, that are waiting for cases to be heard. So I feel somewhat of an obligation if I can do it to be here. Judge Stern says doctors believe the cancer is pretty much all gone, but says she's eating extremely healthy and exercising regularly just to be safe. John, back to you.